We start tonight with ongoing allegations of animals being mistreated at Lucas County's dog shelter LC4. A former employee is lodging more abuse claims weeks after another employee was put on leave for being accused of abusing dogs. Melissa Andrews talked to this employee about these latest accusations. Mel, lots of animal lovers out there. It's getting a lot of people upset. The former employee calls her Facebook post a cry for help to show what the dogs are living in and going through on a daily basis. Haley Blackford describes one coworker only letting dogs out for one bathroom break a day, with some dogs under his supervision never going outside. Also, him dragging dogs down the hallways by their necks and eventually then being promoted to a team lead. But her account of another coworker's behavior is even more disturbing. Now, the law states that dogs who bite and are euthanized before a 10 day quarantine period must be tested for rabies. That is done by decapitating them and then sending their heads to the health department. So Haley says one coworker got satisfaction out of euthanizing the dogs, first by snapping their necks, then decapitating them holding their heads like trophies for pictures. 11 investigates interviewed County Commissioner Pete Gherkin last week before these latest allegations. We wanted to know what he thought of the job Warden Kelly Sears is doing regarding multiple complaints about the treatment of the dogs. We're evaluating Kelly. She knows that we added uh, HR staff over there. We put our chief of staff over there for a while because we want any evaluation to be accurate and in real time to do it. Uh, I think because there is crisis over there now, we added resources to that director staff to get us a good picture of what needs to be done. Blackford also accuses Sears of sweeping these actions under the rug and describes Sears as uninvolved, insensitive, and disorganized. 11 Investigates reached out to Lucas County Commissioners today who said the commissioners are aware of the Facebook post. We don't have any further comment today. For 11 Investigates, I'm Melissa Andrews.